What's up people, Andy here. Welcome to Disney Week. I told you guys in my live stream that I'll be doing like each week there's like a different a network like different networks like it's like kid shows that I used to watch so uh, well it's Disney Week. So uh for me well, like I said in my live stream, we're doing the major shows. Well, in well, in the weeks to come, I can do in the weeks to come. I'll be doing the minor shows as well too. So, uh, let's do this. So, all right. So, Playhouse, Playhouse Disney. Here we go. So, back when I was a kid, I used to watch Playhouse Disney a lot. I watched the Koala Brothers, the Wiggles. Well, the Wiggles were like actually like in like in a uh, in Blast Disney before they moved to Sprout. Yeah, it's something I I might know. So this well, Blast Disney was back in it was like it was launched back in 1997 and was uh, defunct back in 2011. Yeah. Yeah. Now, granted, I was in fifth grade when uh, Plus Disney got defunct, replaced by Disney Junior back in when did Disney Junior was launched? Let's see, Disney, Disney Junior, TV station Germany. Yep. Yeah, this was. The Disney Junior was a uh, a program blog, just like just like Playhouse Disney, and it was a, a TV channel back in 2016. So it was a program blog between 2011 and 2016. So anyway, let's dive into Playhouse Disney, and I'm not going to use the uh, some of the uh, bumpers and inter interstitials on, Play on Playhouse Disney because I might get copyrighted. So uh, I'm not going to not going to do that. Now, former programming. Yeah, this is off of Wikipedia, so yeah. So the two shows that I'm going to explain are Bear in the Big Blue House, and uh, let's see, they got they got they got a bunch they got a bunch of original programming. I seriously, I hope someday that Disney Junior will air these original shows. Yeah, to uh, to new uh, to new audiences. So, uh, all right. So, Bear in the Big Blue House, and let's see Jungle Cubs. No. Yeah, Bear in the Big Blue House and PB and J Otter. What well, I'm going? What well, I'm going in order here. So, Bear in the Big Blue House was, but well, first aired back in 1997, and. Last well, and his final episode was in 2006 with a TV special, Big Bear, Bear in the Big Blue House Live, was aired in 2002. Well, season three, I think, according to Wikipedia, let's see locations, let's see, um, let's see, nope, let's see, season. Oh wait a minute! Wait, wait a sec. Season four focused on Woodland Valley itself. Yeah, I think I've seen some of the episodes centered in Woodland Valley. I think. And well, I think I can explain one more one more series called Out of the Box. Yeah, I might cheat a little bit on this one, but bear with me. Well, bear with me, all right. <laughs> bear. See what I did there? Yeah. Last episode was This Is Your Life, Bear. Yeah, it was sad to see Bear in the Big Blue House go. I hope someday that Bear in the Big Blue House has like a, a reboot or something with all the original cast and characters. It's like, n like No McNeil, but as well as Bear. In fact, I got my uh, old Bear cover right uh, old, old stuffed animal right there. Can you see him right there? Yeah, I had ever since my first Easter, my first Easter back in uh, 2000, I think. I think it was like in April 2000 when I got him, or it's like 2001, I think. 
Yeah, yeah. So the overview of it, it's in, the, in this big blue house. Look, look at that. No, McNeil you know, got got him right because I think I've seen a video about Bear in the Big Blue House. I put the link in the description, but I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. Yeah. So the can well the cancellation. It's in the front door. I don't know. Yeah. So this cancellation was. The vo well, the voice actress Luna, by Lynn Thickpin, that's her name. Cerebral hemorrhage, she died due to cerebral hemorrhage. What's up, Nothing, buddy, what's up with you? Nah, yeah, Craig just walked in the room while I was recording this. Yeah, plant film version of Bear was put on hold. Seriously, if there's if there like Bear in the Big Blue House movie, i definitely see it. And plus, um, I've seen like, I've seen a trailer for it on YouTube. It was like a, um, it was like a tie into like Thomas the Tank Engine, I think. Well, I think it was like, I think it was like a uh, TV spots for Barely Big Blue House along with Madeline Dragon Tales. Don't believe me. Hang on. Let's see now. Um, let's see. Let's see. Thomas and Spencer Reese. Nope. Thomas and the Magic Real Beach just open. Yeah, this was it right here. Opening to Thompson the Magic Real 2000 VHS version 1. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen that, I've seen that, I've seen that video. It's uploaded by Dr. Seuss Lover. So, Thigpen's death led to Bear in the Big Blue House being canceled, I think. Crew's hearts were just in, weren't just in it. Well, there, well, Luckily, though, there's a spinoff called Breakfast with Bear. The new episodes are turning dizzy. January 2006. Yeah, there's all the songs. Yeah, international airings were outside of the U.S., such as Playoffs Disney UK, like a, uh, a UK affiliate of Disney, the Australian Broadcasting Company, and RTE2 in Ireland. Well... They won, they won some awards such as the um, <laughs> Daytime Emmy Awards in 2000 for Outstanding so Sound Mixing. T well, time with, with Bill Nighted Science Guy. And I'm in front of the kids. 2003 for Outstanding Directing the Children's Series, Mitchell Kriegman, Dean Gordon. Parents' Choice Gold Award winner in 2000 2002. And Director's Guild Award for Outstanding. A director of achievement in children's programs, episode 225, Love's All You Need. Yeah, to me, Burn the Big Bull House was like a staple of everybody's childhood growing up in the 90s and early 2000s. Same thing as me, though. It's kind of nice, too. I like how the characters were. Well, at the beginning of each episode, Bear would sense the camera. I kind of responded to that. It was kind of nice, too, man. It was, it was kind of nice, too, you know. He sniffed the camera. Which means that some spells good like pancakes or clean clothes or something. If I did, if I if I did that, I sniff my camera lens. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. Sorry, I'm not gonna do it. Next, well, that was barely the big blue house. Second one, well, I'm gonna switch out of the well. There's like out of the box second, and PBNJR will be third. Alright, well, out of the box. Yeah, no. I'll incorporate some Wolfenstein tune in this. Let's see. Out of. Out of the box. Yeah, hang on, there we go. <clears throat> now, fair warning though. There's like Wolfenstein 2 anthology ahead. So, I think, well, I think in the future I might do like a Wolfenstein 2 out of the box anthology. What the? Grandma's home? Anyways, I'll be right back. Hi. Hey, Grandma, you're home. Yep. It's fine. Yeah, my, my squirt's out there. <laughs>
and I'm back. Now, uh, let me let me incorporate Wolfenstein 2 stuff out of the box. So, <clears throat> so out of the box. Well, I've seen it before. I've seen the opening intro of it up on YouTube. I think I don't know. Uh, so, uh, it ended like a year later after the Bear in the Big Blue House, but it ended a bit short, like two years short of the Bear in the Big Blue House. Also, it ended on September 27, 2004. Well, 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 I really ran until 2005. Well, a year later in the UK, well, it ended reruns. It takes place in the box, or I would call it the kid version of the, of the Over the Commando. Minus the drone super soldiers and underground train tunnels. Yeah, so the uh, mayor of cardboard and uber concrete, or super concrete, which was the, which was the uh, Nazis used to build these monstrosities. And besides, I've seen, I've seen, well, I've seen the, some gameplay Wolf of the New Order, Germania, A.K.A. Berlin. It's like Hitler's mega city, you know. Yeah, well, I'm not well. Believe me, I'm, yeah, I'm ballsy for that. Yeah, I'm ballsy to talk about Wolfenstein too in a kid show. Yep. Yeah, so Tony James, that's the name, and Vivian Bayou Bay. Nah, I'm not gonna incorporate stereotypes about that. You know, make crafting songs and act out plays. Yeah, make crafts out of uber concrete and build them up. Yeah, so yeah, three seasons and eighty-two episodes. Well, the um, let's see how many. Uh, it's yeah. So two VHS specials were by by Walt Disney on the box retreat now the box Happy Holidays, which focused on the holiday season and Halloween. So every day, a group of neighborhood kids came out and playing in the box, measuring clubhouse, kind of like Mickey by Mickey Mouse Clubhouse or the Mickey Mouse Club. In fact, I've in fact I've seen the ending of the Mickey Mouse Club, well, the ending theme song of it called the Alamo Modern. And that's I almost cried about that, you know. All right, let's see. Play games through crafting sounds and act out stars in the box. What difference makes? Sorry, guys. We interrupt this uh, kid show for a vlog. It's kind of bright in the kitchen. Finally. Yeah, finally. Who can see? Uh, yep, there it is. You can see the uh, glare on the lens. Yeah, I'm gonna put it up there with the other light bulbs. So grandma's home. I'm home, honey. Here it is. Yep, there it is. Oh, look at that, guys. What oh, triple chocolate cake, huh? I don't need it. I don't need a sugar rush for that. Seriously, if they focus on health, like health reasons and stuff like that. Well, well, so in this video, it's just about kids shows that I've watched and other stuff too, so let's continue. Alright, the goodbye song is sung by Acapella or Tone Tab and a Pumpkin rather than a drone. See, these guys are future DIY YouTubers, I'd say. Yeah, so like 82 episodes, one production number. Well, due to copyright limbo. Yeah, see what I did there? Source protection codes and air dates is the U.S. Copyright Office. So, pick a patch ships away. Yeah, I think um season. I think season two or season. I think season two had the most episodes. I think. Correct me if I'm wrong here. All right, hold on a second. Out of the box. Let me see. Where could it possibly be? There was circus, I've seen that, but... Let's see. Oh. Yeah, out of... 
out of the box. Or kids version of DIY do it yourself. So episode list. Season one ran the longest from 2001 to 2004. So my guess had most episodes I think. Nutcracker sweet, kids with kids, Father's Day and stuff like that. Like and different, Happy New Year. Yeah, here are the here's the cast. Yep. So that was a uh, out of the box. No, out of the box. Yeah, I think Mom and I uh, got like an impression on that. Out of the box. If seriously, if out of the box had a reboot on it, that'd be great. My guess, all the kids in the box are Dashi had members, you know. Well, my guess, before and well, before the video last night, I, I practiced my video, so uh, yeah. So now, PB, PB and J Otter. Yeah. So the third one that today will be. PB and J Honor. I mean, maybe I can talk about the Wiggles, but I think I think I'll do it. Just, just for the sake of this video, and just, and just for the sake of all the Wiggles fans watching this out there. So let's do it. So, well, around the same year as out of the box, PB and J Otter aired March fifteenth, nineteen ninety eight. Only 65 episodes during its, its its three season run, with the final episode airing on September 24, 2000. I was like one years old at the time. Well, my first birth, well, when, when my birth was 1999, so I think I was one when it it was over. Although what, it was like a Halloween special, it was the last episode on October 15, 2000. Well. It was centered on the Otter family who lived in rural fishing community. Yeah, rural fishing community here, man. <laughs> Most of us revolve around the Otter kids. The eldest brother, Peanut. Younger sister, Jelly. And baby sister, Butter. They went to the peanut butter jelly sandwich. So, only 65 episodes with 130 segments. It ran from 1998 until October 15, 2000. What? Well, it won an Annie, was nominated for any award for Outstanding Music and Anime Series. So, Jelly is the male child of the other children, leader of the group. Yeah, it comes up with ideas that are not feasible. Yeah, Pina is the eldest brother of the family and the group's other leader. Yeah, butter, but says simple words now and then. I think I can't relate to Peanut at this point because I'm like I'm like a group leader, you know. Yeah, Opal on Ernst all under. Yeah, bunch a yeah, bunch of uh, other characters. Supporting characters, yeah, voice but well, Wanda and Walter Raccoon. Well, Wanda's voiced by Kareen Orr. For those of you who don't know who Kareen Orr is, she voiced Trixie in Speed Racer, well, the um, American, um, well, the, well, the American dub of Speed Racer. Yep, you see, told you so, told you. Yeah, if I heard Wanda's voice, it kind of reminds me of Trixie. Yeah, I've watched, but uh, I didn't know that Speed Racer existed because I was like too busy watching PB and J Otter, so I think. I didn't know Trixie was like a raccoon. Yeah, Trixie. Yeah, so, uh. Yep. Fool's Gold Loaf. So, PB and J Otter. I kind of, like, I kind, of, I kind of like songs in all the segments in each episode. It's a shame that it ended quite early. Yeah, well, I think all three seasons were spanned in like in, in a two-year run, you know. All right, I can't turn back from this. I can't turn back now.
the Wiggles. They're Fantastic Four. You know what? I'll, st I'll see my answer. Yeah. These guys are from Australia. There's four of them. The Fantastic Four. Yeah, ever since 1991, these four had toured the world. Well, mostly the U.S. and Australia. I've heard about these guys before, ever since I was little. My mom hated these. Guys. Yeah, my mom hated them, but they gained like they, they gain like a cult following here. For my guess, it's like years to come. You know? Yeah, I've seen these guys before on TV and on the internet. Well, my guess, the, since the rise of YouTube, these guys have garnered like millions of fans around the world, mostly on YouTube. Well, they like they've like a. Uh, they were in a YouTube video well, with the YouTuber named Life with Beans, I think. Plus, I've seen that video with the Wiggles in a YouTube video. Yet, yeah. since its inception in 1991, they're going to do changes with like the cast members like due to old age and stuff like that. Yep, these guys are... The Wiggles. Yep. So, yeah. Alright. The Wiggles, here we go. Yeah. So, these four. Yeah, the original ones weren't that bad. You know? So, Greg Page, Mary Cook, Jeff Fat. That's his, that's his name. But with two T's. Alright? That's Great Up and Anthony Field. Well, Anthony, he's like the longest member ever since 1991. Plus, I've seen their movie. Which wasn't that bad, no doubt. If I had Speed Racer in there, if, if I had me a Speed Racer, it would be a lot better. But, you yeah, know. Yeah, they, yeah, they were formed in Sydney, Australia. So Anthony Field, Lock and Galepsy, Simon Price, and Emma Watkins. So they well, one existing member and three new members, two male and one female. You see, the original members were Mary Cook, Gray Page, and Jeff Fat. Yep. Well, Page retired in 2006 due to due to his due to being ill. Yeah, origin. Now from 1991, you see, they have like tons of success, plus Courtney and plus I've seen the Wiggles wiki page, it's not that bad either. Yeah, the new Wiggles era, ever since early 2013, when I, well, I, was, in, I was in middle school when, when it happened, or 2013, I have to say, um, Probably seventh grade when when it, when that happened. Plus, uh, I've seen some of their songs. I think I'll list them, but in the name of full disclosure, um, got acne on my face. Don't don't try to look at it. So, uh, oh boy, fruit salad. See, I can't turn back from. I can't turn. I can't turn back now from this. Hands, toes, knees, and toes. Yeah, I think I might. I might even watch that one someday. You know, just to make sure. Besides, when I play some, when I play some Forza Horizon Four, when I made my uh, Jeep Joe Cab going like 130 miles an hour, blasting it, red lighting it, I'll be listening to that. Yeah, I've seen call show called Ready Steady Wiggle. I've seen like I've seen like a few I've seen like a few dozen times I think. Yeah, current members are Anthony, Lockie, Simon, and Emma. Yeah, Greg Page, however, retired due to due to ill health. 
Still live. He's still living. Plus, I've plus I've plus says it's on YouTube channel. I think. If I can look it up. Hang on. So, hang on a second. Just give me. A, just give me a minute. Got a, got a screenshot of few a few few things right here. I have got a screenshot it. Mm -hmm. Right now. Ladies and gentlemen, the original Yellow Wiggle, Greg Page. GRG Greg Page. Uh, yep. Still there. I feel the YouTube channel for the original Yellow Wiggle, Greg Page. Yep. This guy's great. The uh, newest. That was like four years ago, man. Man, what the? Yep. Yep. Great page. Great guy too. Great guy. So that's about it for that one. So tomorrow I might cover uh, a few other, a few other, a few other shows, but. You have to wait and see for him. Thanks for watching. Hit that sub button for more vlogs. Like, I'm going to share. Hashtag, I'm my creator. Next week, Nickelodeon. Later, dudes. Peace out. Hashtag, I'm my creator. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out, my dear.